it was unbelievable because I didn't expect such a place like this. It's beautiful, it's awesome. You can hear the water is flowing, the air and the trees, you know, the nature, and that's nice. The reaction I have is when I came to this place, I said, wow. You are able to use the landscape, the nature, the animals to communicate something about becoming aware of the environment, which is very important for leadership. And what we instill in a program like this is that leadership is actually influence. And leadership is um, being a change agent, being the person that, that brings about change in your environment. Most of these young people don't have parents or are being raised by foster parents or living in child-headed households. Yet, they still have the leadership potential that makes them stand out to be able to come out to a program like this. What I want us to do is talk about what you become aware of and what are some of the things that we need to, to be thinking about and so on. That's why it's going to be happening. Each and every day we had a different topic that we were talking about. Each and every day they taught us different new things and each and every day it was something different, it was something new, something totally fresh. One of the essential elements of the program is to show people what's possible. A panorama of exciting openness combined with exposure to great icons of their history, the appreciation of the natural beauty, that they're part of a greater earth system, and the personal journey of exploring what's important in their lives all combines, I think, to add a picture in their lives of what is possible, how they can move out of where they are in the toughest realities. I went to the academy, I kind of doubted myself. I never thought that uh, maybe a 16 year old who is like me can be a benefit in my community. I can make a change and I can be something that can help other people. I'm 100% sure I can stand for myself and my community. Be friendly to others, be focused, be potential. There are many things that I have learned and my behavior has also changed and I believe that I'm, I'm totally a different person. On the Leadership Academy, we learned what our values really mean to us, and it made a huge difference in what I thought of things then and what I think of things now. My dream is to become an accountant and having my own business. So I had a real experience sitting with the elders, having the discussion, and I saw that I can do it, and I can be who I want to be for the future and I can fulfill my tomorrow. I can also be the leader of tomorrow. Our job is to almost take them as a Coke can, shake them up, and, uh, as, and, and release the greatness that is there already. It gave me a positive attitude. It gave me a loud shout that, that says, God, you are young and you can be able to do things. When you're working with people, the leadership course had a lot of impact in my life because when we came back from the leadership course, we started with a lot of programs, a lot of projects in our school to upgrade and to improve our school. Not only our school, our community as well. It's amazing to watch the transformation and just to see the willingness to grab the opportunity and um, the excitement that on the one hand to go back and share their, their experiences, but on the other hand, sadness that this week is going to come to an end, so they would want it to um, continue for a lifetime. My mother just told me, you know, the way you speak and everything that you do right now, I can sense it and I can see it in your eyes that you're now becoming an honest person. And now I've got new friends because of the character that I have since I went to the academy. And some of my old friends do say, God, Carol, you have changed. What really completes uh, this vision is how we can contribute and get engaged in on an ongoing basis um, in the building of people, building their lives, making future leaders. So our focus is on education because we believe that that's actually what this country needs to create economic empowerment for previously disadvantaged people. But one of the, the areas that's missing is this whole idea about values and values-based leadership. So. Columba 1400 really fits in very nicely then. We don't have any other programs that do what it does. So we believe that it kind of supports the other education projects that we are already investing in. Because it looks at that ethical, moral fibre that we need to create in the youth of South Africa. 
it's an opportunity to share and to learn at the same time. And our experience with some of our funders to date has been that uh, they really love getting involved with the children uh, post-academy in terms of mentoring and guiding and so on. And there's huge potential in that. It has opened my eyes. It has opened my eyes to other greater things, you know, because I myself, I don't, I don't come from a very, very wealthy or rich family because um, my background is not very, very good. But I'd say it has given me that hope, that courage, that, uh, that motivation, saying that, you know what, it's, it, doesn't, it doesn't only end here, it just begins here. The impact on these young people is that they go away from this place with a, a renewed sense of self-belief that they can make a difference, that they can be the agents of change in their communities. And actually, we are not surprised, but we still get surprised by the amazing things that they go home and do, the projects that they start in their school, the projects that they start for their community, as a result of them having come to a realization that they are leaders already. Um, they don't have to wait for a position to be a president or anything like that. What we think we'll achieve in this program is enable young people to find it in themselves to transform their own lives and discover the joy of transforming the lives of others and ultimately create, be part of a movement to create a massive change in our country.